you look at this deck, right? Everything seems to make sense. You see like the, the Twisted Fate. You're like, okay, Twisted Fate, you see it go hard. Like, yeah, this is a meta deck control. What's, what's interesting about this? Well, I will tell you, there's a few things that are interesting about this. One, it is from a Glop viewer, and it's a deck that went 5-0 in the Seasonal Tournament, which means it has to be insane, right? Because these are the guys that are boosting Glop to high ranks when he's streaming. They're literally telling him what to do all the time in chat, boosting him up ranks. So, it has to be from a great, great player, first of all. Second of all, went 5-0 in the Seasonal Invitational. Third of all, whoever plays TF with Go Hard and then Dying in the same deck. Nobody but the guy with the massive brain that came up with this one. This has to be a next level deck that is going to crush the metagame. I, I can basically just 100% guarantee it based on the fact that it went undefeated in the seasonal tournament. Qualified for the top 32. And honestly, this guy's probably going to get top one with this. Take home the 10k or however much it is. It's the deck where he plays the Fiora that kills my stuff and then goes my Fiora will kill you because she does she has done damage. And then I, I die to the Fiora. It's pretty cool. I'm actually thinking about keeping my entire hand. I feel like I'm trolling. This courier just has to be good against Fiora. Oh my god, a Citrus Courier. Rewarded. It's like, thank you for giving my Fiora something to kill. Yeah, man, you're walking right into my trap card, okay? <laughs> right into it. My favorite part is he doesn't think he is either. Wait. That is not a Fiora. What's going on? Somebody advise me on what's happening here. I'm very confused. The card that my opponent played was not a Fiora. What's going on? Very interesting. But what I could do is very interesting now. I can kill an ally and revive it. And I'll get another Curse Keeper, but the last breath will go off, and I'll get whatever this thing is. Is this like a door? Oh, it's like a door with fists, I guess. I don't know, it looks really weird. I don't like it. I guess it kind of makes sense. You have this like dude who's just carrying it and shit, and then the door just goes, I, I've escaped, and then I'm a door monster. Raw. A Shen, no way. Oh my god. What if I gold card and then his shank can't attack? Be kind of freaky. That would be kind of freaky. I kind of wanted to hold this to use against the Fiora, but this is kind of fine too. Sort of strong. Ooh, the go hard my own thing play? Oh my god. That would potentially, potentially set up a wonderful red card play potentially 4-3 into 3-5 oh my god the combat this guy is insane little does he know that i'm about to play a counter spell card and draw two cards get clapped son easy very very easy should i do it to him again I think it's kind of rude to do it to him again, but I kind of feel like doing it to him again. Let's do it to him again. Why not, right? It's like, oh, hello, your card is vulnerable now, my friend. And wow, what I've learned this game is that you have ways to win with a undying deck when you don't have an... Oh my god, no, you don't, never mind. Holy shit. Or wait. Do we? Do we? We might. I may play a go hard on this. To go hard one more time. And then watch him play another Bright Seal Protector, which will then lead to his Shen doing stuff next round. But that will never happen. You are a piece of shit. Um, yes, a big piece of shit. But I, I mean I might have just let that happen so it actually dies. Because I kinda do actually want it to die. Over like glimpsing. So a glimpse is just a 3-3, then I'd kill it. But I also draw two cards. Two cards is kind of good. I kind of think I just want to draw two cards, honestly. Whoa. Holy. 
Probably drew the most relevant cards I possibly could get in my deck here. Kind of next level. I will do this. Goodbye, T1. You fought well. But, unfortunately... Oh, no. Sharp Sight? Fuck you, man. Did they really have to give a card that's just like plus 2-2 two two and block elusives to Demacia, man? Like, really? They really have to do that? Where's my card that says do area of effect damage and stun things and kill them? I feel like I'm missing this right now. Which is kind of confusing. I feel like I would rather have it than not have it. But I will draw a card, I guess, and then hope for the best. But we get an undying, okay. The pop-off can probably still not happen, but you know what? That's fine, because we're going to get there eventually. So if I glimpse this, I can't play an undying, but, um, you know. I'm not going to let his Fjord. I'm just going to draw two more cards. <laughs> the classic three glimpses played. That's insane. Oh my, another one? Oh my god. Denny, I'm playing the Undying plus Go Hard. What in the fuck am I doing next round? I have no clue, so let's draw a Fleeting card. That'll solve all of the problems that I have. That's a thing. I get a Stalking Shadows or a Go Hard. Okay. If I do this and attack with this, I am maybe griefing. I may be, yeah, I'm maybe griefing. Okay, I will only attack with a 2 2, I guess. I would say Pale is better than Sharp Sight. Pale Cast Keep draws you a card. You don't draw cards in this game. The cards that draw you cards are honestly, they're just made up, they're pretend. They don't exist. Also, can we take a second to realize this guy is playing with a Demacia card back, a Demacia, like, Silverwing guy, and the, the, the Garen board. Come on, man. You real right now? Can't be real life. I am going to zap and draw go hard. I did it. Oh, yes, but he's playing a region that runs to nice. So very fun. Uh, I've completely forgot about that one. Is there a specific reason as to why he has two cards that draw him spells every time they strike? Is there a reason that that is the case right now? Is there also a reason why I'm even trying to kill the Fiora? Like, she actually doesn't even matter. This guy's just going to kill me with other stuff. Don't type Nobify. No, we don't, we don't type Nobify or Deny when I'm waiting to see if my opponent has a Nobify or Deny. We don't do that. That's not the look. Yes, if I, he's not going to have anything. Dude, you, you never rope this. If he's if he has it, you would never rope it. Never. Never ever. He never has a deny or an opify in hand. It's not possible. You would absolutely never in 7,000 trillion years rope that. I know from experience. It just would not happen. I am going to play a Chronicler card. And then, oh wait, is this a summon effect? Wait a second. Hold the phone. If I resummon my Zap Spray Fin, I will have the opportunity to wipe his cheeks. Wait, wait, I should do this first. Because it's an action, it'll bait him to spend four mana here, so he's no mana for deny. Which he also doesn't have. Okay, he didn't get baited, but that's fine. Because now... Bags are being packed. He obviously never has Deny. It's not possible. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Have a great day. Um, I appreciate you. Have a great weekend. It's Monday, but I still have tomorrow off. So have a good night. Thanks for watching, guys. I will catch you guys later. Peace out.
Hey, welcome to the stream today, guys. I'm, uh, I just played a game and uh, it's not going too well. But, you know, so I guess. Um, some, some games are great. Other games are not as great. But all games we play Commander Lydros because that's a fun card. Man. All I need is an atrocity and we're unstoppable. I just play atrocity on the Commander Lydros and then we win. It's very good. Dude, there's no way. It doesn't... Dude, don't tell me. No, don't. Don't. Don't tell me, dude. Don't. Don't. Don't tell me it's still pack your bags in my deck. Don't tell me it's still pack your bags in my deck, please. Don't do that. Don't tell me that, please. Please don't tell me that. Beat it! Haha, <laughs> beat it! Oh man, that guy got baited so fucking hard. Now I'm gonna pack his bags in, it's gonna be GG. I knew that was the interaction, okay? But what I also knew was that if I played Lydros, my opponent would assume, this guy has to attack. But in reality, why the fuck do I need to attack? I don't. That's the answer, I just don't. There's no reason for me to. Play the bitch. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Okay. Look at this guy. I have Sith three of the bold. Look at oh my play is so cool. Oh, look at my play. Oh, look at my play. I attack you. Nobody cares, man. Nobody cares. Cool play. Very cute. So so cute. My big cards do damage. Ooh, big cards damage. Ooh. Nobody cares, man. I really do hate to break it to some, to some of these guys. But that's just the way that it is. I mean, I can let my Ledros die, have his health, and play that and kill him every time. Too big brain. It's maybe too big brain. I definitely want it to be damaged. Let me just keep it cool. Oh my god, this guy is massive. Insane gameplay. Holy shit. No way. The double spell draw. Into triple spell draw. Into tell me this deck does not run Nopify. Because if it does... Well, I... Um, I don't really know what to say, but this is always going to be... Something that's successful here. You can't play Deny. He never has Nopify. We're unstoppable. Absolutely unstoppable. You know, the worst part is this guy thought he was going to win with a Garen. Board against me. I have the power of Santa Claus. I am actually using a Christmas board with a Teemo card back. You cannot beat me. You can try, but you can't. Easy win. A one drop. Oh my god. That is insane. Mr. Control, may I have the current deck code, please? Hey, you know what? I got you. Here's the deck code, my friend. Enjoy. Since when am I using a green screen? Oh, I'm not using a green screen. What would, uh, what would you, you do that kind of an idea? I just painted my wall in League of Legends colors. Yeah. You know what we're doing right now. I need to get my glasses. Okay, I I understand now. What a play. Wow. It's actually next level. Oh yes, my friend. Very good. Very good. I don't really want to be BM and show them how the card works, right? Like I should we do that? It's kind of a BM play, right? I wanna do this first so I have more than my deck. Because the more cards that I draw that say go hard on them, the happier I am. And the harder that we can go.
Hey, we used the card as intended. Nice. And now I get to attack him for four damage. That kind of felt good. Man. Oh. Hello. How are you? Oh. Well. I can do that. Should we actually start with draw here? Can you take the two damage, go hard that after? Because then I don't like take the damage on the other card so the other card can still block. I think that's how I do it. The shark card's okay. So we now do a go hard. Boom. We go hard. Does anybody else just think about the Waka Flocka Flame song whenever they just like see this card? Like the go hard in the paint one? Every time I say it out loud, I just think about that. And it kind of throws me off because it's a really popular card right now and it's played a lot. So it's like every three games or so, I'm just like thinking about Waka Flocka Flame. Oh, the Waka Flocka Flame song or card. Very engaging. I will attack mode him. I miss the old control. Well, you know what I mean? Times change. Don't get stuck in the past, okay? I could definitely understand why you would. I was much more handsome, much better at card games. Um, and uh, I don't know what other positive things that I was. But times have changed, my friend. I am now... I don't know what I am now, but I am something different. I am built different. Just how it goes. What's up, man? How's the day going? It's going phenomenally, my friends. Wow, he's really lining this up for us, huh? Thank you, my friend. How kind of you to give me a wonderful red card. This guy must really just want to go next. It has to be one of those plays. He's like, you know, man, I'm an aggro deck turn five. If he actually has a TF red card, I'm just going to get out of this game and go play the next one. And that's, uh, well, I guess wasn't what he wanted to do, which I respect. The gangplank card. I don't have an answer. Oh, my God. What do we do, boys? We die. I think we die. Yeah. So my gangplank goes to attack mode and does damage. And then I take damage. It's not a great feeling. I don't know. I guess I can have a 4-3 and a 3-2. I draw two because I get the fleeting card next round. I just don't know if I'd rather have like three more or not. Imagine thinking I don't want three more cards, man. Actually insane. He's going to kill TF probably. No, never has forever. We're fine. Or I guess any spell with the powder cake. Also, he will never have that. Trust me. I've ran the math, done the numbers. What a hand, holy shit. Okay, well I, I do in fact draw enough at least, so that's good. And I may draw a card that... Packs of bags, some would say. The Mogwai YouTube intro bug. Okay. This for some reason happens before my twist or as my twisted fate levels up every single time. I still don't know why. I'm very confused. Can block my attack. Do you know what he can't do? Block my packer bags. <laughs> Lamau. No, sir, he cannot. This guy's insane. No way! Oh, rip in, rip in peace, Twisted Fate. Bye, my friends. See you later, alligator. In a while. Crocodile! Oh my god. He did it. This guy is insane. Alive with two health to spare. 
I lose my Commander Ledros. But I gain. I don't really know what I gain. Nothing. I gain nothing. I can play a Citrus Courier without the Plunder. Insane, actually. Probably the best play I could ever make here. Surrendering? For what reason would you do that? I can't fathom it. That game was definitely winnable for him. It really had to be.